For this video starts, I just want to point out that I now actually live stream daily on Twitch. I'm sure you guys all do have Twitch or do just watch some other streamers over there. So I thought I'd just let you guys know that I am now streaming every single day. So what I want you guys to do is to quickly go into the description of this video. I will link my channel right at the top where you guys can go and drop me a follow. It literally takes two seconds. If you guys are maybe on your phone right now, maybe you're on a computer, you can literally just load it up in a new tab and quickly just drop a follow. It's all much appreciated. And the content which you don't see on my YouTube channel, you will see over there live. So I just thought I'd quickly plug that. Yo guys, what is going on? It's your boy Farfetch here, back with a brand new YouTube video. I hope everyone is having an amazing day, and if not, hopefully this video can cheer you up. As I do in fact have a crazy video in store for you all today. What we're going to be talking about is how you can actually decrease input lag and improve response time to your game in Fortnite Chapter 2, Season 2. And we'll be doing this all directly through our monitor settings, which I'm sure you've never really played around with before. I know a lot of people tend to be contrary to actually changing this stuff, as most either don't have the knowledge to do so, or maybe just don't see purpose in it. But let me assure you, a lot of pro players in the scene are doing it and have enabled a very secret feature, which I will be displaying in this video. So you do not want to miss out on that. Make sure you do watch the whole video all the way until the end. Therefore, you're fully transparent with this and can reap the benefits of Azar as well. If you guys do go ahead to enjoy the video, it would mean the world to me if you could just quickly drop a like. It does support myself as a creator and will also then push the video out to further people who actually may be unaware of this method I'll be showcasing. Remember, you can always subscribe with post notifications turned on if you have not already, therefore you never miss an upload on my channel. Also, a huge shout out to these guys on screen, Jack67, Foxy on Fire, and Ty Martin for all using my support of creator code, code fetch in the Fortnite IM shop. If you want to shout out just like this, all you need to do is use my code and send me a screenshot of proof over on my Instagram. Instagram. But with that all being said, let's hop straight into the video. So first of all, what I actually want to do is briefly go over what we'll be changing today and how it will actually benefit your game, improve response time and lower input lag. So what we're going to be altering is a setting called AMA, which is an abbreviation for Advanced Monitor Acceleration. What AMA actually does is give a greater or higher voltage to liquid crystals within a monitor, which then improves one-to-one -one response time to both your display and game, ensures your display is running at its peak refresh rate, and also gives benefits such as a clearer and sharper image to your monitor, making everything that little more vivid as well which is also a great asset to this may I also point out that the way in which you access your monitor settings to enable such feature is done directly through the monitor or display itself and not within your pc so most monitors will actually have side buttons on the bottom or maybe the side to it which allow you to navigate through internal display settings this is where you'll access the ama settings another thing is that not all monitors will have ama compatibility but just a technology in the first place but it's highly unlikely as many monitors in this day and age actually do especially if they are deemed as gaming monitors or anything over 60 hertz i'm sure all 144 hertz monitors do have ama but now that is well out of the way you are all fully aware what the feature does to demonstrate this i'm going to show a phone recording i've taken on screen where you'll see how to enable this as you can see it's kind of straightforward and also when i go into the setting right here you see there is in fact two options to choose between high or premium what you want to select here is premium ama and ensure that is enabled premium is slightly faster than high with only a small cost of an added overshoot to a display and viewing experience which is completely fine and worth the switch it is different for everyone though although premium is said and proved to be better for improving response time you can go off personal preference and give each a try if you don't go ahead to enjoy premium it doesn't hurt to just notch it down a bit and select the high ama instead but that's literally all there is to it there's nothing more i need to say or show about this it's a great feature and really does make the difference to your gameplay hence the reason many pro players are using this setting i haven't really seen anyone else cover this in a video yet so i thought i'd be the first to do so i do enjoy bringing helpful content like this out to my viewers benefit in your experience playing fortnite it's what i do over here on my channel so if you did go ahead to enjoy the video it did help you in any way whatsoever i would appreciate if you could just drop a like for me it's kind of the least you could do remember you can also subscribe with post notifications turned on therefore you never miss an important upload just like today's may I also quickly add if you don't already know i own a fairly large discord server of 27,000 current members we're now taking on new chat moderators and staff to the server so if you're interested in that whatsoever or just generally want to come along and say hi i'll leave a link at the top of the description where you can all join and with that being said i hope you all have an amazing day it's been your boy farfetch and yeah peace